Jay, a scrappy win, but uh, as I said, win is a win at the end of the day. Two one games, what do you think the performance was? Yeah. It was a tough game. Um, Rithin were a good side. I thought they passed the ball really, really well. I think they've had a mixture of results uh, throughout the season, but you know they're obviously a good side. They've some really experienced players in there. I think for us personally, uh, we didn't start the game very well, and I think that was probably the theme throughout. We were sloppy on the ball. Um, we looked a little bit sluggish. I think probably having ten days off didn't help us. Terms of having ten days not playing, but it's about. It's about results at the end of the day. You know, at the end of the season, people are luck. We got three points, so that's the main thing. Uh, Bo Cornish, uh, during the side earlier this week, he made his debut today. How do you think Yeah, he's done really well. He's, he's you know, been away with TNS in Europe. He's had a great experience with them. It's great that he's, he, he's learning from some senior pros there. Um, he can tell a little bit rusty. Hasn't had a, a great deal of game time over pre-season, but that will come. Um, you know, he's come here to get his minutes and hopefully help us kick on. So, yeah, I thought he started really, really well. Yeah. Uh, both our goals could take in from set pieces of Nathan Brown, both Wooden, both in. How do you think he's doing, especially with the set pieces this season? We've scored quite a few off. Yeah, it's something we work on religiously week in, week out. We've got a real big, strong side here. Um, I think we're organised, we're aggressive from set pieces in both boxes. And then when you've got quality that Brownie can put in, even you know Spence in there, Joe Palmer, Ryan Edwards, we've got players that are good with, with the dead ball situation. So. I think we're, you know, both our goals coming from set pieces today. I think when we're not playing well, we're going to need that, and you know, I think that was proven again with how aggressive we are inside opposition boxes. Yeah. Uh, you're currently injured at the moment, so at the time you said you your coach a bit more. How do you think that experience is helping at the moment? Yeah, it's frustrating not playing, um, but you know, I've, I've made no, um, you know, I'm not the company quiet. Made it no secret that I want to go into management and I want to go into coaching, and it's great being on the touchline and learning that side of it from Shosh and Skip and seeing things from a different perspective as well. I think it's quite good that I get to, I've still got a playing head on at times, but I still get to you know, see it as a coach and you know, it's, I, I'm still learning week in, week out and that's, you know, that's great for me, but I do want to be, you know, I'm still itching and you probably see that on the touchline, you know, I kick every ball with the lads. So I think, yeah, it's, it's frustrating for me at the moment, but you know, at the same time, it's one of the main reasons to come back to the football club was to, to to take part in the coaching side of things, and you know, I'm really enjoying that as well. Yeah. And just looking ahead to Tuesday, we've got Conway Borough at the way, um, the first proper away trip of the season, and it's another top of the table clash. How do you feel it's going to go on, on Tuesday? Yeah, we had them watched a couple of weeks ago. You know, again, a, a real strong squad. They've got some great individual players, lads that have got real strong experience in this league. So it's going to be another tough task for us. Um, I'm hoping, and I think we will, you know, we'll have a reaction from the, from the game today. And it's you know we know we're going to have to go to tough places like Conway's you know throughout the year and you know it's another tough test for us um, so it'd be good to see how the lads react and you know we, we get ready and we recover properly ready to go into a tough game on Tuesday.